future, we go two years in the future there to 2021. <coughs> May I please ask the fine and beautiful representatives at DC in 2021 to step up. Good afternoon. My name is Colette Bazard, and I'm here to represent the uh, DC in 2021 uh, bid to host the uh, Worldcon. Um, you can keep cheering. That's <laughs> um, basically, my, my lovely assistants here will uh, begin sorry, to pass out one of our, our flyers uh, if you wish to take them. And also, uh, basically, I will give some generic, some general information about our bid and then uh, open the floor for questions. Uh, we are bidding for August 2021. And we are we have a secured a provisional contract with the Marriott Wardman Park Hotel, uh, where we are able to host uh, pretty much all of the uh, conventions, function space, and a room block of 1,100 rooms that are all within the same building. The the um, the Marriott Wardman Park is a block away. From or it's essentially across the street from the um, Woodley Park Zoo Metro Station on the red line of Washington D.C.'s metro system, uh, three stops away from Metro Center, which is a which is a major intersecting metro hub in D.C. and which gives you access to many of the uh, sites of Washington D.C. Uh, Washington D.C. is also proud to host one of the largest free museum systems in the world, the Smithsonian Institution, which I think now is probably just on its own, is up to about 15 uh, art, culture, museums, all of which are free to attend. Um, we have a fairly experienced bid committee. Our bid chair is, William Law is uh, Bill Lawhorn, and several of our other committee members uh, include myself, Anne Marie Rudolph, Michael Nelson, and um, several other folks. And so I think that's everything for my remarks. Uh, open up the floor for questions. All right, I'll, I'll take questions from the floor. Where's the zoo? The, the, the zoo is about a uh, four to five block walk uh, north on Connecticut Avenue uh, from the Marriott uh, Warman Park. You mentioned this stop, but not why it's called the zoo. No, no, close by. Oh, uh, in the back. In uh, there. For our party situation, the hotel, uh, the Marriott Warman Park, has over 100 suites. We have them all blocked, you know, in our provisional contract, and that, that contract will just kick into effect should we win. It's in place. We don't need to do any further negotiations on it. And we do have a corkage and forkage waiver uh, negotiated with the Marriott, uh, with the Marriott to, uh, to greatly uh, assist parties to be able to uh, bring in the foods that they wish for their uh, type party. And we, and just to continue on that theme, uh, the, uh, the world, we as a convention will be uh, managing the uh, access and the booking of the suites. Okay. Yes. Um, so accessibility for like the metro and everything, is it easy to get on and off on a wheelchair? And yes, uh, the, metro, uh, the metro system is fully ADA accessible. Uh, basically, you you go down, you go across the street. Um, the uh, the you turn you turn left, and there's a um, elevator that takes you directly down uh, uh, in, into the metro station, and uh, and basically, and uh, it is fully accessible. You are able. There is no uh, you know step or anything like that to get on or off of the trains onto their platforms. Any other questions? Hi. Are there any restaurants in your <laughs> 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 Yes. Um, uh, 
uh, we are very happy to say, and uh, there is a map at our fan table down in um, uh, downstairs in Hall E, uh, that there are about 25 uh, restaurants from McDonald's all the way up to um, you know Italian, Lebanese, Taverna, uh, Indian, um, uh, all just sorts of different cuisines within a one block walk of the hotel. Um, there is, uh, the restaurant scene in that area is growing, and so, you know, with a metro stop away, certainly like one metro stop south into DuPont Circle, there's a very vibrant restaurant scene uh, down there, and so, and we will be, uh, we, will, we will be, you know, uh, if we are seated as the world come, we will be, you know, pulling together a restaurant guide for that so people can uh, uh, plan their dining. Grocery store? There are grocery stores nearby. I don't have that full detailed information, but the Marriott Boardman Park is uh, adjacent to a residential area in um, Washington, D.C. So basically, people live there uh, and then and are able to uh, shop nearby. There, there's a small grocery store across the street, Avenue. It's a equivalent of a 7-Eleven with a liquor store next Okay, so I think we have you covered there. Okay. Uh, we get. I get one more question. Right. Thank you. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. All right. This is such a me question, but uh, how's the legal weed situation in DC? <laughs> uh, it is completely legal. Great. <laughs> yes. Good to know. Yes. Just don't step on federal property. But yes. city property. Yes. Yes. Then there's not. And there's not federal property in that area. Great. Immediately in that area, so that's one of the joys of it being it's in a residential area. Too. Uh, you can't go to Rock Creek Park either. So, uh, one more real quick. Will the White House have been negated by then? No comment. No clue. Thank you very much. <laughs>